Hi everyone, I'm back and I've completed the project um, for my friend where um, this is a little tribute frame kind of a hanging. I'm afraid I can't get it all in vertically, but um, my dear friend lost her beloved dog and I thought she might like a little hanger. She can put a photograph here um, well, for her art room or wherever she would like it. So this is the background that I created using the absorbent ground. Um, I think that the red is really showing through quite nicely. And then all of these lovely flowers are from I Am Roses. Um, many of them I've colored with the coordinating Lindy Stamp Gang sprays. Um, and the colors that I used was Peony Scarlet Red, Golden Doubloons Moon Shadow Mist, and Jolly Roger Red Moon Shadow Mist. And then I also left some in the beautiful ivory color. So I'm going to lift this up so you can see the background. And those were some chipboard letters that I had that actually were red that I colored with my Copic marker in a brown to kind of match. Um, it's very sparkly, which the camera doesn't really seem to pick up, but um, I really like how this project turned out and I hope my friend will enjoy it. But just as a promise, I wanted to show you um, what you can do with absorbent ground on the background. And to show you, this is just nothing more than corrugate cardboard. I'll be covering the back. So be sure to give it a try and be sure to check out Lindy Stamp Gang. Um, they have so many beautiful sprays that you can use. Um, the Starburst sprays are really your true color sprays, and the Moon Shadow Mist are the more of a vintage look. They're, they're mixed with walnut ink um, for these beautiful brown tones with color underlays. So I hope you enjoyed the project, and I hope you give the technique a try. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.